Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Gary Hedges, Chairman of the Cambridge Sports Hall of Fame. Today we're here at the Black Shop Restaurant in Hesper Road in Cambridge to announce our 2021 inductees. First, though, a little summary about our organization. The Cambridge Sports Hall of Fame was founded in 1996 and is a registered charity run entirely by a volunteer board. We are self-supporting and fundraise in order to continue maintaining our permanent displays at the Cambridge Center and to hold our annual induction ceremony at the Cambridge Center. We also fundraise to build uh, our Bob Cunningham and BrokerLink uh, Insurance Scholarship Program and to support our scholarship event at the Black Shop Restaurant each May. Our 14th annual fundraising reunion golf tournament will be held Saturday, May 28, 2022 at the Brookfield Golf Club. It is only $130 per person, includes golf, a cart, steak dinner, lots of prizes, live and silent auction, and lots of fun. We are looking forward to a great event. It's now time to announce our 2021 inductees in the Cambridge Sports Hall of Fame. To date, we've inducted 197 athletes, including teams and builders. This year, the selection committee has chosen eight inductees, four athletes, two teams, and two builders. We would like to offer our congratulations to the following. In the athlete group, Madeline Garden, Gardner, and Benedetti, Josh Walper, and Ainsley Melross. In this team category, the Cambridge Great White Sharks, and Lori Beyer and Lloyd Eisler. In the builder category, Bob Howison and John Hancock. We are excited to welcome all of these athletes, teams, and builders in the Cambridge Sports Hall of Fame. And now a brief bio about each of the inductees. The first athlete is Madeline Gardner. She's an artistic gymnast and she placed fourth in the Pacific Rim Champion in 20, Championship in 2010. She was Canadian champion in 2011 and 2011. And in 2012, she was on the Canadian Olympic team. She also has two NCAA National Bronze Medals in 2014 and 2015. The next is Ann Benedetti, and she was an all-round college athlete and gained fame at uh, Western University and at Queen's University for lacrosse and her academics. She was inducted into the Western Mustang Sports Hall of Fame. It's, it's, uh, her father was inducted into the Sports Hall of Fame, and I can remember when I played football at Glenview and we played GCI, always chased the number 32 down as he scored down the field, <laughs> as he scored another touchdown. Anyway, the next, the next athlete, Josh Waper. He was a Canadian champion, champion marksman and wingshot champion in 1901. He was a member of the Canadian team at the Bisley competition in Britain. The next athlete is William Ainsley Milross, and he was a noted professional lacrosse and hockey player in the early 1900s. The first team is the Cambridge White Sharks, and they were the 2018-2019 world champions at the Cheer Union World Cheerleading Championships in Orlando, recording the highest scores over all divisions in 2019. The next team is Lori Bayer and Lloyd Eisler for figure skating, and they were World Junior Pairs competitors in 78 and 79 and 80, and won bronze at the 1979 Worlds. Lloyd won bronze in the 92 and 94 Olympics and 93 world title with a new partner, Isabel uh, Brasseur. The first inductee, uh, builder inductee is Bob Howison, and he has decades of dedicated sports involvement in Cambridge. He was chair of the Cam Canamera Games. He was on the board of the YMCA. He was a pillar in the Cambridge Junior Basketball Program and Cambridge Sports Contributor of the Year. And he's a valued member of our board at the Cambridge Sports Hall of Fame. The last builder is John Hancock, and he's a longtime sports broadcaster with CBC. Covered many Olympic games and interviewed many of the great sport figures of our time. We hope to see you all at our 25th annual induction ceremony, scheduled for Saturday, May 7th, 2022, at the Cambridge Center at 1 p.m. And don't forget the Galt Arena Gardens is celebrating its 100th anniversary in 2022. It is the oldest continuing operating uh, rink in Canada. The festivities will start on January 22nd as we celebrate the amazing rink and landmark in our community. Thank you for watching and for more information about the Cambridge Sports Hall of Fame, check out our website at cambridgeshf.com.